All right, guys, Hugh Deerfield Beach here. We got the Concept 2 rowers. We're gonna give you a little rowing 101 today because we have a sprint relay. First off, you guys gotta learn how to get into a rower. So there's gonna be different straps that are set up, different foot placement, but when you first get set up, you wanna make sure that the foot pedal is high enough or low enough. So the bigger the foot, the lower you want it. So he's got it at a two right now. He's gonna adjust it down to a, about a four because he's a little bit taller. Now the straps, if the strap is too tight, you're not gonna be able to get your foot into it. So we wanna just hold the buckle and then pull from the center of the strap. Now we've got enough give in that strap so that we can go ahead and slide our feet in. So we're gonna slide our feet in. If we wanna flat, um, pull that strap nice and tight, so we're cinched in. Now when we're rowing, us coaches, we know how fast you're rowing. So we're gonna kinda of walk you through. When you guys are going through, there's a different speed. Go ahead and uh, row for me. So when you start out, keep going, you've got this number right here is your second number. That is your pace. That tells us your miles per hour. So when I come over and I tell you that you're rowing like a turtle, if he's rowing like a turtle, you can watch that second number is going to start to creep up there. So now he's rowing slower and slower and slower. So if I tell you you need to row faster, it's because I actually know what I'm talking about. Your third number down here is your distance. So he's rowed 125 meters so far in this little segment. But again, now he's gonna start to pick up pace. We can hear that fan going. And now he's down under a two already. So that is the basics of your screen. So now to get out of a rower, you guys are gonna put the handles in that cradle. Now, you guys can uncense your feet very quickly just by pushing that thing down. If all you do is push it down and you try to pull your heel out, it's not gonna do anything for you. The rower is built to keep your heel in there. So what we have to do is we have to slide our foot forward. Notice how there's a little gap between the heel now, and now you can lift his heel up, slide out nice and fast. So when you guys are getting in and out, make sure that you guys shove your foot forward, slide your heel out, and then you don't have to sit and wonder why you can't get out of a rower, and it's just a piece of equipment. All right, guys, that's your rowing a 101. Remember, ooh, Will's on there. Hard exercise works.